Hey, how's it going, beautiful people? It's been a long time. I wanted to talk about uh, Ezoic Leap. I wanted to do a quick review of Ezoic Leap and show you how to implement it on your website. I actually have not implemented that on my website yet, but it says that I made a video previously about Ezoic Leap showing that it was a coming future of Ezoic, but now it's already live. Okay, it's, you can implement it on your website, but essentially what it does is that it provides everything from optimization feature to diagnostic so that website can pass core web vital it's 100 percent free for ezoic monetization customer if you don't know what ezoic is if you're new to this channel ezoic is a platform that allows you to monetize your website given that you meet certain traffic requirement and that your website is also in good condition with adsense now it serves as like a mediator between ads provider and your website it has this new future it's new and it's rolling out without wasting your time if you are approved by Ezoic if you're not yet approved and you have a website with at least 10,000 monthly visitors then uh, you can actually uh, watch one of my videos how to apply and how to app get approved how to set up on your website but if you are actually approved by Ezoic already on your dashboard and if you set everything up properly on your dashboard you will see this leap beta version leap is now available on your dashboard i'm going to put the link of this article down below so you can actually read all the benefits of what leap can do for your website but it essentially replaces the site speed accelerator it's a better version of that site speed accelerator future and I'm just simply going to click on um, get started okay if I click on I have not yet implemented that on my website but if I click on get started what do we have we have overview core vital optimization settings technology tester leaderboard and it says that right now my core web vital for the last 28 days is 57 on the mobile score 64 desktop score and that's what it says it says here if you point that here it says to get a score of a hundred your LCP okay your LCP must be 1.5 seconds or less FID must be 20 milliseconds or less CLS must be 0.02 seconds or less now right now my current value for largest contentful paint is 4.7 have a lot to do on my site back to speed if you go on the speed if you scroll down actually and these are websites that have a hundred out of a hundred for the scores but even before we actually try to apply their settings what I like about this as well is that it gives you recommendations in the sense that you can for example it's telling you what are the things that are making your site below average for example, Elementor is extremely detrimental and in fact my site, the MMS experience, has Elementor on it. Yes, I have I know about Elementor slowing down website and I know that there are uh, other options but what I like about it is that it gives you options. If you click on alternatives, uh, it actually shows you what are the best uh, builder beside Elementor. The fastest one is WordPress block editor Gutenberg okay so that's the default page builder it's fast and it's easy because when you actually have Elementor on your website not only Elementor is a plugin but it will actually build different blocks that will also take time to load and this is what I realized as well on my website so it gives you a lot of recommendation and also the things to avoid this is the fastest one but do not also try to implement these other builder or these other themes so at least they tell you whether the theme that you should avoid first of all they tell you whether you should avoid it and they tell you whether it's actually free or there is a price attached to it okay it says for example here there's a free version available but also it requires payment and requires pay subscription so it really 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 tells you a lot of things now if I go back to alternative if I go back here it tells you Elementor it extremely impacts my website 
I have to work on that but also you have a lot of things like jQuery so you have the extreme severe and not recommend it right and right here it says for example it gives me the alternative to jQuery like fancy box Zepto it tells me like what other potential like plugins I can use like fancy box is a tool to display images HTML content so I think I might actually go and install this fancy box whatever that is and Zepto or D.GS uh, but if I go back here it also has a leap setup assistant apparently that you can uh, that you can set up on your site so if you click here on setup on your site it says now I am in queue there are 169 customer before me so the, this leap assistant I believe it's probably an assistant or something a tool that will allow you allow you to work step by step in really making your site faster the other thing that we can do in the meantime that I'll, we can actually try to join the leader board would you like to anonymize your website others will only see part of your domain if you anonymize i don't care i don't want to anonymize my website so out of the website that they have ranked you see how to forge.de my website is 481 the score is 57 while other website actually have 199 94 but and you can actually go let, let me just go and try to visit one of those website corporationwiki.com you see how fast it opens i mean it's like a one pager website so i understand why it's probably super fast but let's try another site this is ntg24.de moments later it's also uh, fast it opens in about like one point something seconds and I believe this is in Denmark it's like a blog a normal blog with like blog post but it actually has like blog post it doesn't have like a static page for the website it has like a news page which is a landing page and you can open a blog and actually start reading you see how fast that opens that's why it has the score of 95 it's super super fast you can actually go now on the site try all of those website if they are not anonymized it tells you the ezoic future use the ezoic lip settings that they actually use and the technologies as well that they use they use jquery which is not recommended they use the the ezoic name server as the integration method that it has not detected the theme but essentially here it has this is the ezoic lip setting that they use what i like you can actually try to apply their settings on your site as well to uh, and the ezoic feature they have the ad tester they have the caching they have lip activated they have privacy policy and consent management so this is pretty cool what ezoic is doing okay can try the setting for that website but I am going to try the setting for the website that has 100 out of a hundred okay so if I click on try the settings and I click on so CSS image blah 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 all of them are activated that's what they had on their settings and uh, if I click on next and I click on if I first uh, your image showing properly first before activating you probably have to go to preview to actually see how your website looks like okay cool it loads in about you know one point something two seconds now if I go for example and I read this article it loads in about two point something seconds yes the images are showing properly nothing is uh, nothing has been displaced the ads are showing properly image are showing properly as well next and probably activate those settings hopefully it's not gonna break my site and I'm gonna show you whether it breaks my site or not but I really 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 like this lead feature because it shows you a lot of things that you can set up properly on your website especially for beginners right that don't really know anything about like WordPress optimization or like how to set things up properly what plugins to avoid uh, what settings to use 
the best integration method and so now it is actually activated what I'm going to do is that I'm going to try to clear the cache I'm trying to try to clear the cache first and reload my website to actually see whether that makes a difference and even if right away it doesn't make a difference maybe give it an hour a day or something uh, for it to cash again to fully cash and maybe it's going to try to make it it's going to make a difference after so let's try to open it opens pretty fast like okay one second image I still showing properly everything is still working fine even with the new settings activated okay so if I go here on technologies scan my site again it says your sky your site is being scanned check back in about five to ten minutes for a result so if you're approved by Zoic and your site is monetized by this platform right you have a tremendous amount of tools that you can use to really optimize your site you have free scanning of your website to tell you what is good and what is not good it tells you for example all the plugins okay one signal that I am using it actually severely impacts my website right here on the home page uh, also create a support ticket if you have a problem with your site you can create a support ticket get someone to help you and on top of that as well you have this tester the value must be for the domain the MMS so it has to be for for your website so any page on your website that you want to test so let's go ahead and select for it. select that and I go here and I paste click on analyze it's going to load the result for that specific page and while it's testing that we can go on other spot and actually see so it has a lot of tools all web vitals largest contentful paint it, for the mobile it shows you for the mobile and for the desktop what it actually looks like your LCP score is better than 19.12% of similar site. You can click on here. What does this mean? It shows you that it's the metrics that report the render time of the largest image or text block within the visible of the text block visible within the viewport. Also, if you scroll down, it will tell you the worst pages with the largest contentful paint. This one, for example, how to recover a hacked Instagram account fast. It has the worst interesting if you see for example the page that is the worst that has the worst largest contentful paint you can actually copy the link of that page right here go under tester paste that page here analyze it and actually get more details about it okay it, sh it shows you not only the score for that page it shows you like the page does not pass the core web vital right now but not only it tells you that it doesn't pass but it also shows you the opportunities the things that you need to do to increase for example you need to reduce initial server response time it shows you all the things that you need to do that are really required that are recommended for the diagnostic it shows you a lot of things i really 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 like this future honestly at this point is like i think it's just going to grow it's just going to be amazing in the future with a lot more features it replaces things like google page speed inside this future also replaces things like gtmetrics.com but it's all in one for those who use Ezoic. I'm not saying this is the best platform ever but I like the fact that the company keeps improving with new features it provides deeper analytics than most uh, monetization platforms out there as well so if you want to join Ezoic you want to click on the link down below there is also an alternative to Ezoic that I am currently covering I'm also going to put the link down below of that alternative in case you're not approved with Ezoic and you have like 30,000 monthly visitors or more there is also that alternative below that I suggest you check that out I am going to release a video about that maybe in the next week or so or maybe in the next two weeks but there are so many tools that I want to cover that I think are going to be helpful 
and I really want to provide in-depth reviews working step by step most of the time I don't even like I haven't tried those tools first and sometimes I, I and I walk you step by step as I am trying or I have tried the tool already and I am doing an in-depth video review just so you don't have to do the hard work trying to figure out things as well I hope that was helpful if it was please smash the like button leave a simple like gentle like it's free subscribe to the channel until next time take good care of yourself I love you guys peace and don't forget to smash like and subscribe thank you